Hi everyone, it's Jenny here from Texo. In today's video, I'll show you how to use an outgoing webhook in a workflow. Webhooks let you send data to third-party tools automatically. Let's dive into how to set it up. Understanding the webhooks. Webhooks are a fantastic way to send real-time data from Texo to another application. This helps you connect Texo with various external tools easily. Setting up an outgoing webhook in Texo, it's a simple process. I will start by demonstrating a workflow that I have created. It's a sample workflow. So first I have set up exporting some profiles and then scraping them. After this step, I want to use a webhook node in order to uh, export that information. So what I will do is I will select the operation and then outgoing webhook. And here I can double click on the node to set it up. Configuring the webhook node. First, we have the webhook URL. That's the URL provided by the third party tool that you're integrating with. In my case, I will use a sample one. Then we can choose the request method, such as post or get. Next, I can select the data that I want to send. For example, first name. I could add as many data points as I want. In this case, I want to keep it simple, so I will just select one. And now we can decide um, if we want to use some rate limits. In this case, I will select one to keep it simple. And then we can select any interval if we want to set that up as well. And now our node is set up and we're ready to run the workflow and see if our webhook is working properly. We can see here that our workflow is working. We can pause it if we want to. As soon as the workflow reaches the stage of this outgoing webhook node, your webhook is going to start working. So whenever that step of the workflow is reached, it will send data to the specified webhook URL. In this case, it's going to be coming here. Incorporating outgoing webhooks in your workflows lets you link Texo to other tools and enables you to have a more efficient and automated data transfer. So that's it. That's everything about setting up an outgoing webhook in your Texo workflow. It's very straightforward and easy to use. And thanks for watching and see you in the next one.